many so-called Christians will be thrown into hell? Most times, what are you even talking about? Christians aren't thrown into hell. Well, many people call themselves Christian, but they're actually not. They're actually very, very confused. No, we're not going to pull up a video today. This is a very, this is a very serious conversation that we're going to have, and it's very, it's lukewarm Christians. And many people call themselves Christian, but they're not. I mean, you see all these celebrities that are like, "Oh, I'm a Christian, I'm a Christian," but when they're not, there's this one lady out there right now. She calls herself a Christian, but yet she's drinking. I mean, I'm not saying drinking, but she's like at clubs drinking and getting drunk, and she says Christians because. Today, the thing is, you call yourself a Christian that you are uh, supposedly a Christian. Let's see here. Oh, no. Oh, wrong light. Oh, no. I was trying to fix my camera and the light went out. But many people do. Many people say that they are when well, they're not. Many people, call, many people call themselves Christians. Because nowadays, Christian is like a name that everybody calls themselves. Everybody. It's a name that everybody has to handle to. I mean, I'm sorry that might make you mad, but it's just true. Many people call themselves Christians when they're not. Many people say they are when they're not. You have to be careful. You have to expose that. You have to see they truly are. You know? Like, they may say this, but many will be thrown into hell because they may have read their... Many say it just because I believe or just because, you know, I go to church. That doesn't really truly mean anything. Paul says everybody believes in God. Satan himself believes in God. Satan himself believes in God. Take that. Take, think about that for a second. Satan himself believes in God. So just because you believe, you don't mean anything. I'm telling you, many people do believe. Many people believe, but many, but many people actually go to heaven. I know I'm moving my camera around a lot right now because I'm trying to try and get the best angle possible because I was kind of like over here, but many are. Many really, really struggle. And they truly believe that they're going to heaven just because they may believe or just because like, they're labeled themselves Christians. You can't just step on, step on a name tag and boom, you're fine. Because that's, that's just not how you roll. It's just not. It's just not. I'm sorry. It's just not how you roll. And yeah, you have to, you have to truly be, you have to truly be ready. Because God... Could come down at any time. You have to truly believe that you. Yeah, I mean, not believe. You have to truly be a Christian. You can't just name it. But yet you're still going out and getting drunk and partying. And maybe I say partying. What? But like, you know, going to the club and getting drunk. You know, that's what many people are doing. It's okay. And it's it's worse than having. You know, like, I mean. There are drag queen pastors out there. It's getting it's getting nuts. It, it truly is. It's getting insane. It is. It, it, it's okay to be doing all that. But it's not a church if you are doing that, number one. I'm sorry. It's just not. And, I mean, you're probably like, Wait, the, what, what are you saying? Why are you discriminating? I'm not, I'm not doing anything. I'm, I'm, I'm telling you the truth right now. The Bible clearly says no homosexual will ever inherit the kingdom of heaven. And it's, that, that's the truth. I'm not, I don't have it pulled up right now for my computer, so I can't put it on the screen. Because I wanted to be able to talk face to face. Because of, and it is, uh, it also, it's also 9 o'clock at night, but, on a school night, but <laughs> I just, I really feel like I wanted to make this video. But, so think about that. So make sure you're truly right. Make sure you're saved, number one. You have to be saved. The Bible, says, the Bible says, many will cry out, Lord, Lord, didn't we prophesy in your name? Didn't we cast out demons in your name? But you never really did. I mean, yeah, you did that, but he'll say, depart from me, I never knew you. Because you're not saved. You never were with God. Made use of his name. You're never truly with God. And just please, please, please. Oh, I'll pull the Bible verse. I'll pull the Bible verse right, right up here, right up here. Many will, many will, many will come to God and cry out, "Lord, Lord, didn't we prophesy in your name? Didn't we cast out demons in your name?" 
and that's not the full verse, but I just wanted to get it, but it'll pop up right here, and I just wanted to get that through. That's about it, but I really just feel like the Lord put this message on my heart that I really, really, really wanted to share that with you, that many label themselves Christians, but they're not. They're just not. That's about it. Please like and subscribe if you haven't already. I thank everybody for watching this video that has. I know it's kind of short, but like I said, it's really, really late at night, and I'm going to bed, but I'm out.